animated Night of the Living Dead is a new animated film that released by Warner Brothers about a couple weeks ago or so. Uh, this film was is running at a price point of $20, though if you want it right now, I bought it for $10 at Target on sale. Now, this is not everywhere. Didn't see everywhere this is running at that price point, but if you want this at that price point, definitely go ahead and pick it up. Uh, if you want it at that price point. But let's talk about this film. Um, this film is kind of a worthless movie. And I feel like that's weird to say because, you know, every film, no matter how bad it is, no matter how much pisses me off sometimes, has an audience. Um, but this film is just worthless because I don't think this film does have an audience. It's a very awkward film. What this film is, it's a remake of the 1968 animated film, shot for shot, sequence by sequence, of Night of the Living Dead. It's just a recreation of it, but animated in color. And I don't think anyone who likes the original Night of the Living Dead would want to watch this film. They might be curious about it, and they might watch it once, but they're not going to like it. A, the animation is... So, for example, the best thing to equate this to is like a DC animated film. The DC animated films, while not great, they're low-budget direct-to-video movies, they still look pretty good for what they are. Yeah, you could ask for better, but really, they're direct-to-video, so they're not going to be too high in budget, obviously. This looks exponentially worse from there. All the movements of the characters are very stilted, very not quick to move very well. And that really, it, it's just awful looking. And so I don't think someone who likes the original Night of the Living Dead is going to like this movie. It doesn't really add anything to the original Night of the Living Dead movie. Uh, it being animated, like it doesn't add more horror. It isn't scarier. I guess the zombies are easier to a little bit buy more in like current day animation compared to like 1960 special effects. But I still feel like, you know, you don't really notice those old school special effects in black and white films like that. Unless they're bad, like something like Plan 9 from Outer Space, you know. Um, so I feel like in something like this, right, because it's in black and white, you don't tend to really notice that. So it doesn't really add anything. For this film to be animated. And some. Okay so someone might go. Okay well this is for a new generation. Let me ask you this. Do you want to encourage a new generation. To watch a lesser version. Of a classic film. And so. And I think the argument for this film would be like. Well what about kids who don't want to watch. A 1968 black and white film. Well first of all. Don't encourage your kids not to watch black and white films. Like that's just dumb. Like. Yeah, they may not see the point in it now, but try to make them understand it and not be afraid of black and white older filmmaking. You know what I mean? Like, it's just ridiculous. Um, this film is fantastic. The Night of the Living Dead is a fantastic film, and it still holds up. It's still a great movie. So if you watch... So this isn't. I don't understand where what the point or audience of this film is. And that's where my frustration of this film comes. It's not one of the worst films ever made. It's like the Lion King remake. Except except it's not nearly as awful as that film is. But this is a film where... Because at least this is just going to be promoted for a little bit of time and disappear. That Lion King remake is going to be forever staying on the legacy of that franchise. Uh, of the Lion King franchise. You know, this isn't. This is just going to disappear. Um, but it's still frustrating that something like this exists. Um, I would like to see um, something more with this animated film idea of old classic films. Not really necessarily complete remakes, but maybe like sequels or continuations. Like Because Night of the Living Dead, if you don't know, there's an unfinished script, I uh, believe, of Night of the Living Dead for a sequel called Night of the Living Dead 2. And they could take that script and just make it animated. Because... You know, the issue with uh, 1968, uh, Night of the Living Dead, is there isn't a sequel. 
uh, and they're, you know, and, but there's a finished script. And you can't really make a sequel the same way you would now because it's so, you know, times have changed, blah, 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 actors died. So what if you did that now, take that same script, do it animated, right? You could do something cool like that. I don't really see the point in completely remaking a classic film, uh, just animated. It's good. Uh, when the classic film is already good, just leave it alone. And you know, unless you have something new to add to it, and this clearly did not. There is no, I don't think there is an audience for this film. That's why it already went on sale after only hitting stores two weeks ago. So yeah, let me know what your guys' thoughts on this film is. Thank you for watching.